The Battle of Gladane occurred in the village of Gladane in 1998 between the Kosovo Albanian militant group known as the Kosovo Liberation Army and the Yugoslav military and Serbian police forces during the Kosovo War. The clashes represented a series of military offensives launched by the Yugoslav army and a Serbian police to address a growing KLA presence within Kosovo Albanian villages. Chapter 1 Background In Kosovo, the Kosovo Liberation Army forces gained strength and tended to control villages away from the main roads while Yugoslav military forces were positioned on the hills around Lake Radonjic. Throughout the summer of 1998, Yugoslav forces shelled Albanian villages, surrounding Lake Radonjic on a daily basis. Chapter 2 Clashes The Yugoslav forces first broke through the KLA lines and entered Gladane around 10 the 11th of August 1998, as reported by BBC correspondent Jeremy Cook who was on the scene. He reported that the Serbs knew they had the upper hand and had shelled and machine-gunned the village of Gladane into submission. Cook reported seeing houses shelled and livestock slaughtered to prevent rebels from re-entering the village, the Serbian paramilitary police were involved in the operation. The next military offensive involving Gladane occurred in the beginning of September. KLA forces had regrouped and in September, the Yugoslav military moved through the villages around the lake in order to attack and expel the KLA, Colonel John Crossland an English military officer attached to the VJ witnessed this first-hand commented on the destruction caused by those forces. He noted that he personally witnessed looting and burning of houses by Yugoslav forces and that the village of Prelep was raised to 18 inches about the ground. He stated that VJ forces, Serbian police forces and paramilitary police forces including and JSO were involved in the offensive dot during the operation, KLA member Idris Gashi murdered a civilian suspected of collaborating with Yugoslav police. Her body was dropped into the Radonjic Lake where, along with other bodies, was found in September 1998. Gashi was found guilty and was sentenced to 14 years in prison by the Kosovo Supreme Court in 2010.